Good morning, guys. I'm Mary from the Mary and Joe channel. And I'm Joe. And we are on our way on a road trip to Huntsville, Texas. Know who that is. Show Clive watching people feed the fish at the park at the gazebo. Well, we got water in Dan B, y'all. Everybody should be happy. Now that we know, and when it was empty, that it didn't have very much water in the first place, but it looks better with a little bit of water. But if I had a boat, I wouldn't turn out across there with you. Yeah. We don't pull our big fancy bass boats out here. Unless you got an Arkansas travel, that's the only thing you want to get out in there with. But it looks a whole lot better through here than it looked with no water about a month ago. No way. Let's see how much water they got under this trellis, I call it. It's old fashioned. We're leaving Jasper County and Tyler County line. A bridge like this, you probably won't ever see it again. It's early in the morning, really early in the morning. And I know you'll notice that I didn't comb my hair today, but I'm trying to save it for the game. When you're outside at a baseball game, your hair goes to holy, you know what. So I'm going to try to have a few curls when I get to the game. If, I don't, if they fall out, I have a visor, so I'll put the visor on. But for now, I'm going to have to be looking like this all the way to Huntsville. It's about uh, one and a half hours from where we live. So we're on our way. This is what we're going to. Says congratulations to 2020 Jaden Adams on being selected to the at 2D Sports at 5-2 All-Star Game September the 14-15 at Sam Houston State University. Congratulations to Jaden. And this is Jaden. And that's our grandson. He's a senior at a 6A school in Richmond, Texas. Yes. Jordan Ranch High School. First city we're coming to on One Night West is Woodville. It's about 30 miles from home. We're going straight through on One Night West. I promised on my last road trip video to try to show you guys all of the county seat courthouses. And we're at the corner where Woodville's courthouse sits at 190 and 69 or the 287 loop. So they have a they have a pretty big courthouse. We're on the other side of Woodville and this is Tyler County. So I'll try to make a note of what all counties we go through. This is Polk County. I'm sorry, I just missed the sign. If you'll notice, in this part of East Texas, deep East Texas, we have lots and lots of trees and pine trees. And the roads are two lanes in this area. We know you Californians think Texas is in the desert. Not. We got plenty of pine trees. Who's from California? They think Texas is, is, is in the desert. Well, I hope I have some people from California that watches my videos, but I have some from Carolina, Australia, I have some from Germany, and but a lot of the uh, subscribers on your channel, you can't see where they're from. So I hope I have some out there from California. Some people that far off don't see trees, but I think in South Carolina, North Carolina, we've been there 
And they do have trees. So we're just about to go through the Indian Reservation. And it's the Alabama Cushada in the res Indian Reservation. If you ever go through this part of Texas, that's what you'll see out here on 190. It's about a 10 mile stretch that's on the road. First Texas Indian Church. On this reservation, they have a casino. They got their own water tower now. Oh, that's New Joker. The water tower. So Joe's slowing down so that I can let you see the sign. Home of the Alabama Cushada. And we're 17 miles from Livingston. It's all our little signs to the casino. And it does good business. Our most favorite place out here is their little store. This is the store of the playground. And here is uh, the Alabama Cushada store. So the next city will be Livingston. Let me go ahead on and tell you, in case I forget to turn the music off, because we listen to Sirius Satellite Radio in our car that we have to pay for. And we do not own any rights to any music. But sometimes uh, we're riding along and I see something I want a video. And I forget to turn the radio off. So, I need to state that. We're entering the city of Livingston, Texas. And it says, uh, welcome to Livingston. This is where the road first turns in to four lanes. Instead of two lanes. Going to the big city. We're going to downtown Livingston, Texas. This is the county C, so they have Polk County Courthouse. So on, on 190, it seems like we go to a lot of towns that's the county C. So we're at the corner of 190 and Texas 146 and they have a big old um, pretty courthouse that, uh, ooh, that I miss most of it but um, at Christmas they'll have it decorated when we're going to Houston we usually turn that corner but this is going straight through on our way to Huntsville, Texas. So we're at 190, and this is Highway 59. If you take a left here, you're on your way to Houston. But we're gonna continue straight through here on Highway 190. Headed for Huntsville. I love to video water towers when we're going through on our road trips. And here, here's their water tower. We'll see what it looks like. It usually has the football team in these small towns, uh, their name up on the water towers. Livingston, we just, we just went through the city limits on the other side. On Alaska, then Huntsville. And this is Lake Livingston.
give us five minutes, we'll be through on the last one. There's their water tower. That's one light, and here's the second traffic light. We're still going west on 190. The next little city we come to is called Port Blank, and it's sort of an uh, island on Lake Livingston. Oh, no. Well, how do they get this little island for? Where the city is? Because it's man-made. No, the, the, the lake is man-made. Yeah. Okay, this is the pretty part of Lake Livingston. It's kind of hazy today, but it's really, really pretty. Huntsville 
has the the, the first pillow to take. <laughs> the the big house. But the correct name is the Texas Department of Criminal Justice System. And it's right here in Huntsville, Texas. So after the game and after everybody else has gone home, we are going to try to do a tour and we'll try to be sure that we go by there and show you where the Texas Department of Justice, or what I call the big house, is. Follow us for the tour of Huntsville video. We're about five miles outside of Huntsville. So I tried to comb my hair, but I had this little old mirror. And um, we're gonna meet up with the rest of the family. Y'all, it's a family outing. It's our grandson playing all-star baseball. And uh, we're gonna meet our family in Huntsville. We're passing through the city limits of Huntsville, Texas, population 38,548, y'all. We made it here, and I guess our first stop will be at Sam Houston State University, where we're gonna uh, meet the kids, and Jaden is gonna play baseball. It's quite early in the morning. This is an overnight, this is an overnight trip, y'all. They have to play today which is saturday and they have to play tomorrow so it's going to be an overnight trip and uh me and joe Klein has opted to stay at the best western hotel in huntsville texas so after the baseball game joe and i intend to do a little tour of uh downtown huntsville we've been here uh one or two other times and when we get to the college and we're going to go and, and meet with our uh, family group who's here to see Jaden. Okay, we're coming up to the college. And uh, what we're looking for is Bauer Football Stadium. Here is a sign for Sam Houston State University founded in eight. 1979. This is Huntsville, Texas. Our son Joey just called us and told us there's no parking at the baseball park that we needed to park at Bauer Stadium. We're driving around on the campus and we finally find a way in and uh, Bauer Stadium is up in front of us so we're going to drive up here on this hill and see if we can find a parking spot that's close to the baseball field. So it shouldn't take us long. They said it. We're, uh, we were getting close just to come on up the hill and we'll probably be there. Let me see if I can get a good picture of that. So we're here and we'll find our way. Well, we found us a parking spot and we're walking up to the baseball field and oh, it's a bright sunshiny morning. I can hardly uh, film anything because it's so bright. But we're here now and we gotta go and find where our family is. We find our kids at the stadium. They're just waiting and it's till it's their turn to play. And this is Jaden and he is number 20. And he, we are outside the stadium, and this is our family that's here to support Jaden today. Now, I need y'all to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel, and look at our next video for the game.